Hi, um, it's me again. Um, bringing you another train simulator video, and today it's going to be a bit of a different video because we're doing a comparison of two products for train simulator. So the products we're going to be focusing on today is the class 321. Now there are two versions of this pack: one manufactured by Dovetail Games, and the other by Armstrong Powerhouse, who um, uh, na who pretty much all the time produce really high quality stuff. So, I haven't really set this up much, so I'm just going to take it on a quick drive. So, um, let's find it. So that, the, uh, we'll take a look at the AP321 first. We'll go first Capital Connect 8 car, because that's the only one that comes with the DTG321. So I want to take on ECML and Peterborough, and we'll start at Potter's Bar, but we won't go to them. We'll go to Potter's Bar to Hatfield. Actually, let's make it four cars so it's quicker. Right, let's start. So I bought the Dovetail Games Class 321 a, uh, a few months ago, and. Um, it's it, it, hmm. uh, it, it wasn't the best product in the world. It was a bit of a disappointment, really, because I know I I I, I, I so the types of trains like the class three two one, class three one seven. Uh, then I, 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 the kind of like my lo local services. So I was a bit disappointed to find out it wasn't uh, simulated very well. And I think the 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 main cons of it was the door sounds and door animations. And uh, I think the sounds of the doors, when they opened and closed, they were copied, or recycled from the 1938 stock, which came with the Isle of Wight pack. Um, and the door animations were too fast. It was almost like a tube, a tube train was opening them as well. And the doors just basically weren't convincing enough. They just didn't look like the real thing. The train, the body of the train, the shape of it wasn't right. But AP of completely changed that in this um, new product and it's really good so we'll just wait for it to load I'll identify some of the new features um, I have had to turn the volume down slightly uh, so you can hear me but that shouldn't affect the train sounds oh yeah the, the sounds the sounds are much better as well and they, they also introduced little things like a new destination blind for it which is really nice nice little feature um, and loads of liveries as well, you think you have. First, Capital Connect, um, Greater Anglia, National Express, London Midland, Network South East. You have basically every, every livery that the 321 came in, apart from um, Great Northern, because they didn't have the licence at the time, but you can get reskins for it, so it's no big deal. So yeah, we'll just wait for this to load. I will make the review kind of snappy because I don't have loads of time to record this. Hopefully we'll get a decent frame rate as well. We are on a laptop after all. Come on game, it's normally loaded by now. It was a bit slow earlier, it kept on it kept on kept on freezing. I think it actually froze while we were recording for a sec. I'm sorry, I don't know why this is taking so long. It's just stupid at the moment.
Now the game's frozen again. Come on, wake up. Oh, there we are. It's back up. Back on again. So what I'm using to record this with is Game DVR, which came on the Xbox app, and you can only use it if you have Windows 10, which I do, which also means I can record more than 10 minutes so I can, my videos can be as long as possible, well, as I want, to, want them to, um, and I can get a good frame rate on it, unlike, um, the, the, I've gone through quite a lot of screen recorders, <laughs> the first train simulators I started to videos I started to produce were used by Bandicam and that wasn't too good because you can only produce 10 minute videos and the quality wasn't so good. Then I used OBS Studio which ran at about one frame a minute because of the um, because it didn't run, run very well on my laptop. And now I've, and now I had a little research and I found about about, about game DVR. Tested out um, the uh, London London Fabishman video I did was recorded using it. So yeah. I'm starting to get a bit concerned about this game because this is just abnormal. It's never ever taken this long to load. Ever. Oh, hello, we're in. I don't think we have sound. Oh, no, we do, we do. Forget that I said. We have sound. So. Welcome to the Armstrong Powerhouse Class 321. Now, I really like this train in real life and how APO represented it. So I think what I'll do now is I'll just show you around the little features of the cab. So we have a driver reminders appliance here, which can be told using by clicking on it or using the Y key, which, oh sorry, F key. Uh, we have a carriage reminder, and the the class 320 that comes with this pack unfortunately isn't in 3, 6, and 9. It's in 4, 8, and 12. But you can't have everything. You have you have headlights and mark lights. Day headlight and mark light. I'll put that on. And what I love about this is we have a destination display, which is something DTG321 doesn't ha really have. So we are going, we'll just put it in for Sings Hatfield, no let's put it in for Hitchin, which is 00925. Hitchin, Viwell and Garden City. Because that's basically where this will be going. So, I think that's it. You have um, pantograph up and down, I think, but I won't play with that because I never. Yep, yeah, pan down. So you can see, the pantograph has now gone down. And if I press pan back up, it should go back up. It should go back up. Come on, go back up. Pantograph's being a bit weird at the moment. Turn up. Do press one of these buttons? Right, now that sucks. Um, hmm. Um, I'm assuming the train won't move. This is breaking. No. I'm really regretting doing that now. You have to put that there. 
Oh, hello. Yes! We're back. Right, let's reverse it a bit so we can pick up this. Here in Potter's Bar. Okay, so door animations on this are absolutely spot on. So we'll just... And of course those doors didn't open, which is really annoying. Why does it always go wrong when they do this? <laughs> those doors did open! Oh gosh. You also have the option of driver only um, doors, so you need to do that or that. I'll put it on driver so I can shut them because the doors are annoying. And uh, yeah, it's just it's a pretty simple train setup as you saw earlier, just put that into thing. The horn is good as well. <laughs> Very nice, although it sometimes cuts out under low frame rate. Yes, it always does. Oh, another thing, you need to go to activate the tail lights, you need to go in here and click the button manually. Right, let's close the doors and actually show the door animations in all its glory. You can disable the DSD by pressing Control Shift E, or and you can acknowledge it by pressing E. So let's head off to Havild. I'll pop myself behind the Pantograph carriage so you can hear all the lovely traction motors. If the train will move, oh, I need to do this, don't you? Let's go. Train, you absolute idiot. Move, please. This is all going fine. As you can see, maybe the simulation on this is a bit too advanced for its own good. Especially for people like me. Move, for goodness sake, move! I need to show off the I need to show off the sounds on this thing. Can we move now? Of course we can't. Oh no we can, we can, we can. Let's head on to the other train now. Right, so, go same distance, stop at the same place. So, let's find the DTG, class 321. What I might do is actually turn down the ambience noises because it is it's, it's going to be loud. This train has a really loud kind of motor thing. Save that. Hmm. 
Here it is. So as you can see, I've got a couple of reskins for it. I'm going to take it in first capital connect, because that's what we did before. Same time, same places. And let's go. So it only comes with first capital connect, but I've got some liveries for it. Gonna have the same situation as last time where the game takes about an hour to load. I think it was five minutes last time, but this train is less a lot less detailed, so it should be quicker. It's always the worst on the first load in a while. I haven't played this game since the, the um, London Faversham video. something I've got about seven minutes to do this review so I need to be quick okay so here we are in the dovetail games plus three two one it's very loud it has a very loud thing noise um it's really, it's a big difference, really, in my opinion. The door, I, right, let's, let's start off with the doors first, because I think this is the main thing to be moaning about with this train. Elf the 1938 stock, I mean, come on. So, this train does not have a automatic display thing. It just comes with what it spawns with, but it can be changed in the scenario editor, so that's not really a big deal. Um, as you can see, it's a special because this is a video and it's for a special occasion. The lights are too bright uh, for, my, for my liking. Very simple um, cab setup. Very loud. AWS. Physical. There go the doors. So wait, we still have a counter. We have a um, guard thing as well, which is good. It doesn't feature driver only operation though, but that in mind. Obviously we won't have the same pantograph problems because it's just that P and P. Right, so horn isn't right, the set off. Very the physics on this aren't very good either, to be honest. The brakes are on.
mention this with the AP31, but it doesn't have the D the AP31 has doesn't have capacity with where this one does. It's not very good, but it does have a nice magazine in it, which you can't really see. Um I think that's pretty much it. So I'm just gonna say my verdict on this. I think if you're if you're struggling, if you've just uh, kind of joined the train simulator if you just got Train Simulator and you're you like the 3T1, I'd say buy the AP1 because it's definitely more authentic experience and you'll be able to relate to the sounds, the simulation, how it really moves. And yeah, um, I thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you found it helpful um, in choosing which products to buy. And yeah, I will see you in the next one.